And I'm getting mighty tired of your traveling ways and of listening to that jackass Bray. All right, you guys, what's good? What's Gucci? So got a little bit of extra time. Um, I'm watching the clock. Gonna do a quick uh, tarot request line. Um, also, after I do that, I need to do, um, I'm, I feel like I need to do a cutesy video. I hear it, I feel it. I'll definitely get it, I'll get it going. Something just happened where that guy, you know, hey boo. Yeah, something just happened where uh, I got a, a, a low-key spiritual tap on the shoulder like, now, Orana, make sure that you do X, Y, and Z. All right, let's do it real quick. All right, real quick, what we got? Who's in here? Leo, let's do Leo. So a love reading for Leo, Sun, Rising, Moon, Venus, Leo. What's going on in love for Leo? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Just. Ooh. Hey, Leo. And Cancer, two Leos in here. Three Leos in here. Back to back to back. I know you a Leo, Kim. Hey, boo. All right, the first thing I pulled is the sun. So, good times ahead, bright times ahead. Um, innocence, youthfulness. Uh, let me see, hold on. Mm. This is a reminder to be uh, more playful in your relationships. Your inner child, let your inner child shine through and also be lighthearted, be fun. I'm hearing cancer partnership with some of you. Surprisingly, cancer Leo relationships tend to be pretty spicy. They tend to be pretty good. Ah. Okay. This is a relationship where you're going to enjoy the getting to know you process. You're going to, you know, work at it, like, you know, um, take the time to court each other, get to know each other's likes, dislikes, you know, the work of putting in a relationship, but it's going to be pleasant work. You're going to enjoy the process and all that. This is the Seven of Pentacles, so some of you are going to have something with an earth sign. Uh, Taurus, Virgo. And now I gotta go. <laughs> I'll make a cutesy video later, but Leo, that came up for you. The sun is good, the Seven of Pentacles is very, very good. Seven is a divine number. Um, this is specifically what I like about the Seven of Pentacles, right? They focus on their work, the hard work, and they're enjoying the process and trusting the process, and you see, like, the castle in the background, you know what I mean? So it's like... Putting the work in and enjoying the work as you go will lead to beautiful destinations and um, beautiful results in the in the partnership. But the person that you're currently entertaining, Leo, this is really, really good. It's going to be really, really refreshing. Have fun. Make sure that you uh, show them the inner child in you, okay? Because you can be really, really fun and really, really sweet and really, really giving, Leo. Um, the phone calls. Hold on. Y'all know how, you know, y'all don't give a fuck what everybody else is doing. You better call me at this, that, 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 that. You, you better, like, all that. How y'all be on that? Um, for some of you, y'all gonna have to uh, tone that down a little bit because some of y'all are dating some busy people. And the, the, the key is maintain your boundary, maintain your line. You already know what to do. But, you know, some of y'all want somebody to kiss y'all ass. And they're not going to do that. But it's not because they're not really, really into you. It's just, like, they gotta get used to your energy. That's what it is. It's, it's, not, it's not a bad thing. It's just they have to get used to your energy. So just make sure, um, specifically, just make sure that with that area, in that specific department, that you just don't go so hard. But don't take no shit, of course. But don't go so hard, okay? I'll be back. I'm up. And I'm getting mighty tired of your traveling ways and of listening to that jackass Bray.